Yo. Hey, man. Hey, man. How you feel? Good. I'm just making sure everything's set up so I can see. You can see that okay? Better? Start. Yo, 100 times. Okay. And I can see your feet. That's perfect. How about me? Yep, perfect. That's perfect. Okay. We both have Trueform trainers now, so thanks mm -hmm. to Trueform for that. Thank Did you have any trouble getting it in your house? I thought it was one of the easiest things I've ever moved. I mean, first off, it's incredibly lightweight. Um, I'm actually a little shocked because I have a Trueform runner in the city, and I have a Trueform trainer here. And uh, I, to be honest with you, like this is, I'm, 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 I, I guess because the Trueform runner that I have in the city is way older, but I, I think this this is exceptional. It's lightweight, very very portable. So. Yeah, I'm pretty happy too. So <laughs> it gives us a chance to do this. Like we we never really had a chance to do this both on the treadmill. So this is this will be kind of cool. Just a little experiment here. So so uh, have you done anything uh, before this? Like any warm up or anything like that? Yeah, you know, I did some stretching. I mean, earlier on today, you know, I've been going through some um, some breathing, some movement, and um, obviously a uh, workout this morning. So I'm moving throughout the the day. So I'm, you know. I'm, I'm pretty good to do whatever you need to do to get ready and then we're ready okay. to Okay, well, why don't we just do like, uh, maybe like just two minutes easy on the treadmill just to get the legs moving, get your bearings on the treadmill, and then let's kind of, you know, we can kind of talk and go here too. So, okay, same time, right? Yeah, this is not a competition, okay? So we're not racing oh, no, each other. Please, I, I'm not racing you. You're out of your mind. <laughs> <laughs> not, yet, not yet, at least. So the one thing that I know that you're very, you know, you spoke about a lot in that tutorial the other day was, when you're on this trainer, making sure that your strides are very similar and that you're able to maintain a speed. Yeah, you're just trying to keep even rhythm and it's very easy. And this is the same of running on the ground too. If you push too hard with one stride, like it really, it really throws you off. So you're just trying to keep yep. that even rhythm. And right. all I, all, all I, <laughs> I'm getting tired here. All I really think about is just like lift, lift each stride. I'm not thinking about necessarily pushing. I'm just thinking like lift the next leg and if you lift one leg the other leg's going to put force down but they you know they've said the scientific studies have said basically this is 30 percent harder than normal running is that what it says yeah 30 percent okay. more cost how did we figure that out so i have no Sorry. idea but after hey. running on it i'm like yeah at least 30. oh hands down both starting to quiet up a little more now. One minute forty in. You're, you're you're monitoring your heart rate too. Yes, I am. Yes, I've got my monitor on, but it's not displayed up here right now. Wondering if I have to turn something on or. Okay, so let's walk walk a bit. Yep. Yeah, I'm breathing. Yeah. Oh, I just hit reset. So the heart rate versus heart rate at the bottom. I don't even need that yet because this is gonna re record. Yeah, we can always tell everybody. <laughs> I'll show the graph of my heart rate later. It's interesting because I've been using first beat to measure all of my anaerobic and aerobic work, which is fantastic because I feel like now you know be able to target my workouts, you know, in reference to the range I feel I need to be in. I've been diving a lot into Omega Wave. You know, I used to use it years ago, and I just dove into it this last week. They have a new system that Val sent to me. And so I'm getting really starting to get reacclimated. I wouldn't even say comfortable yet. That was a minute of walking. Let's get into another minute of running just a little bit faster. Okay. Just a little bit. So I'm just at about eight miles per hour, which is comfortable. Right now, so it's the top number's pace, right? Yep. And beneath it, it says speed. My speed says like, 12.9, but I think that's the wrong setting. Oh, well, it might be kilometers per hour. Yeah. You might, you, might, you might have a Canadian one. They should have shipped it to me. <laughs> but I should be able to switch that. I know I have. Okay. Walk it out. That was another minute. Um, Maybe you are going miles per hour. <laughs> no, I'm not running that fast right now. What's your speed say right now? I'm walking at three miles per hour. Yeah, it says I'm walking at six. So. Yeah, so it's 1.6, factor of 1.6. So you're walking a little faster than me and, and it's probably kilometers per hour. Yeah, I'll figure out how to 
you hit 16, it means you're going 10 miles per hour. Yeah, they shipped you the Canadian one. Well, there's got to be an adjustment here. Right? Yeah, dear Ryan Reynolds on it. He'll know what it means. Yeah, he knows what it means. <laughs> okay, so let's go 30 seconds a little harder, okay? So we're just doing build-ups, really. Yeah, 30. So see if you can get up. I'm going to get up to about 10. So you're about, I think, yeah. 16 kilometers. Yeah, I'm at 16 right now. Good. Go halfway there. Let's go another 15 seconds. It. And let's break this walk. We'll walk a bit. Good. We'll do one more of those, and then we'll get into a sprint workout. Sure. Oh, so it's good to get loose. Yeah, today was my rest day, and I'm doing this. Dang. What are you doing? What's a rest day? What did you call it? Rest day? What does that mean? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Probably some easy body weight stuff and oh, easy walk God. and I'm going with a walk I'm going for a walk with my wife after this. Okay. In the shower. Keep the dogs on the causeway, it's right in the water. It'll be nice. You drag me out for this. Okay. Come on, man. This is great. The question is, is how many days a week are we doing this? This is fun. I don't know. Well we we got it since it's suit up with Dom, we gotta wear like a shirt and tie and slacks one time. <sighs> I'll send you, I, I have new shirts coming in. I'll send you my shirt, you send me your shirt, and we'll both. Okay. You just got to put yours in a crop top. Okay, <laughs> just tear the sleeves off. Okay, in 10 seconds, we're going to go another 30-second burst, try to get over 16. Sure. Three, two, one, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and let's walk. Okay, so that was, for everybody watching here, that was about eight minutes, and all we did was two minutes, easy, one minute walk, one minute a little faster, one minute walk, 30 seconds faster, one minute walk, 30 seconds, you know, decent speed. All right. Feel like you're warm? Yeah, for great. I'm sweating. So am I. <laughs> I was waiting for okay. you to say that first. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what we're going to do is, I'm going to say this, you know, right now, but we're going to do it together. I don't know okay. if I can hold, hang, hang, out, hang with you, but yeah, um, sure. six seconds, maybe we'll take like 90 second breaks, two minutes at most, sure. and we'll try to do four of them, okay? okay and all so I want you yeah. thinking is, is one is I want you to get it going. So hold on, get it going, pull yourself in. And then, you know, all you're thinking really is lift the thigh, lift the knee, put it down. And okay. once you put it down, really all you're thinking is, I want to get it back up. Don't think, once you hit that, that treadmill deck, you're just thinking rebound off it. Don't think push back. As soon as you push back, you'll get sucked back. Yeah, so yeah. It may feel odd. But once you get the hang of it and hit that sweet spot, all you're think, all I'm thinking in my head, being 50 years old and a little less elastic, I love how you had that. Lift, <laughs> lift, 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 lift. That's all I'm thinking. Up, 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 up. At, at around four, four, four and a half strides per second. So, I mean, I don't really have a lot of time to think about four strides per second, but that's roughly where I'm trying to get to. So, okay. this is a six okay. seconds. So we're basically. Six seconds on at 100% pretty much. Without yeah, just go. Just, just motor. So, so. And, then, and then we're Six 90 seconds. seconds walk. It, it's going to be about 25 strides, right? Okay. So we're I'll, going to have some. I'll, I'll, I'll go on your time. It's probably about a four to five second build up to get there and get in position. And then it's another five seconds to hold it. Five to six. Okay. And then I'll, I'll count out the, I'll do a count to six. And then we both sort of grab on and relax for a minute and a half too. Okay. Uh, I would just say done. When we're done, I'm going to listen to you. I'm not, I'm not paying attention. Yeah, I'll just say body. done. <laughs> yeah, all right, good. Ready? Okay, ready? Let's get it rolling. Yeah. Two. And let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Done. Oh. Woo! That felt good. Okay. So oh, that's, see, I can't get this kind of sweat on a bike. And maybe I'm just not working no hard way. enough. But. No way. Also... What I'm finding out is I've been running outside a bunch and I think I've been overstriding because uh -huh. my hamstrings have been so sore. And when I got on this, it actually 
almost retrained me to get my knees high. And then yeah. I felt like my hamstrings weren't bothering me as much. Not painful, just soreness. Like I just felt like they were never really re recovering. Yeah, and whenever we do hamstring rehab with pro athletes, I mean, that's our opportunity to work on technique because that's probably one of the reasons they pulled in the first place. Right. So, so what I'm going to do on this one is because I just because I'm older, a lot older than you, Don, and I need a break. I'm just going to count it out and watch you do it so I can okay. help with technique, and then I'll join you in on okay. the third one. Okay. Sounds good. So, Are you sure? We got another 30 seconds, and then we'll do it. Yeah, I just want to take a look at you. You have a much nicer uh, setting backdrop there than my. Uh, Pretty, isn't Martian, it? <laughs> my, Mar my Martian wasteland here. Yeah, but you're going to put behind that screen, you're going to have like a beach or something up later something, on. I, I know something. you. It's like you Jeremy Johnsy resting on the beach or something. Yeah. <laughs> you're exactly that beautiful tan. <laughs> you ready to do this? Yep. Say one. Okay, so let's get it moving. You're going to count it up? Yeah, so let's build it up. Build it up, build it up, build it up, build it up. Just think up and down. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Good job. Good job. Good job. Done. 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 Okay. That's looking good. That look? That's good. Yeah. More vertical, you know, same sort of things. Just try to, like I said, just try to stay over top of it and just think up and down, up and down, like you're in the phone booth. And so let's yeah. just keep doing that. So you got another minute and a half here. So that's two. We're going to do four of these. Perfect. I'm still sweating from just walking here, watching you. I, I love this stuff. Fortunately, I feel like I recovered pretty quickly. So, oh, you know, okay, so I enjoy. We'll, we'll go a minute and a half. Oh, whatever. Whatever you want. I understand the importance of recovery. You know, this is like, it's funny. Even if your cardiovascular system feels recovered, you know, the ability to repeat may not be. I think that's in simplest terms for people out there listening. So, but certainly having having this treadmill in your home now is a bit of a game changer. It is for me. I've got, I've got my whole family oh. on it. Oh, my God. Just, I couldn't believe how lightweight it was. We yeah. literally picked this up, me and uh, this delivery guy, uh, Zach. Zach and I picked it up and carried it in. We were like having a conversation. Nice. See that was a trick. So 30 seconds and we'll get into the next one. Yep. I'm with you on this okay. one. Okay. a boy. You're not old, Pete. Come on, brother. No. You're only seven years older than me. I don't want to hear that crap. 50 is the new 30, right? And it sure is. <laughs> sure is. 15 seconds. Not a boy. Three, two, one. Okay, so let's get it moving. And ready, and let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, and break. Woo! And I think that's the, the interesting thing is that it may seem like, oh, six seconds, those guys aren't doing that much, but no. oh my God. Yeah, it's funny. I, I kind of enjoy from day to day mixing up the tempo work, which is kind of what you would refer to what I did yesterday with the minute on, minute off, right? Yeah. Um, to today where these are definitely more high intensity bursts. Yeah, this is way, it's just a different type of intensity, you know? Yeah. I mean, the heart rate may get up to more of a max height doing a lot of that tempo work because you're doing that for a duration, but the, what you're requiring your body to do in a short period of time is way more intense than what I had it doing yesterday. I feel like you need that balance, Derek. What do you think? Yeah, it's just like a race car, right? Like, you know, how much does a Formula One car burn on one lap versus a Honda Civic, right? So, right. How many are we doing? Is this our last one? This is our last one. So 30 seconds, we do it. We take a bit of a break, and then we're going to do some intervals. And I want to do something fun where we do a bit of a relay, where you do 30 <laughs> seconds. And then you take a break it. while you're during your break. I do my 30 seconds. And we just work back and forth off each other. Uh, I love it. Okay. So 10 seconds here. Last sprint. And usually I might do these in sets of four or two or three sets total. Yeah. We're trying to get a lot in here. Okay. You ready? Sure. Yep. Let's go. And let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. I had this function. I had this function on my watch. It's a Garmin, and I think it had a function where, if your heart rate jumped up in a really short amount of time, it would send an alert out to family, like something happened. So I'd go out and do sprints, and every time, like people, my parents are like, "Hey, what happened to you? We got an alert." I'm like, "Oh, I guess I was sprinting." 
They thought I had a cardiac event. <sighs> That's funny. My wife just actually said, Garmin, my wife just got a Fitbit just to primarily track steps. Yeah. Um, she's enjoying it. She's, she's been sitting at the desk so much that this kind of allows her to get up and move around and she has a goal of 10,000 steps a day. And you, you know how that works. It's a good number. Yeah. There's something about doing this in the afternoon. I really enjoy splitting it up. I get like my resistance work in the morning. And I feel like this in the afternoon kickstarts me, you know, yeah. that second win. Okay. So we got 20 seconds here. I'm going to, I'll go first. I'm going to do 30 seconds. And then sure. as soon as I say done, you jump in and do 30 seconds. Let's just work back and forth for maybe four times. Okay. okay? Sounds good. And usually I'm trying to get probably about 11, 12 miles per hour. So you might be 16 to 18 or 12 yeah, miles sure. per hour. Okay, yeah, sure. Ready? Yeah, that's right. I'm going first. Let's go here. for it, Go, man. Come on. Do that for him. 10 seconds. 4, 3, 2, 1, hand off. Okay, I got my time. I'm about 19 right now. Okay. Good job. Just sleep up and down on the phone booth. Good. Okay, let's go. Yep. Oh. Okay, five yeah. seconds. Four, three, two, one. Egg off. Tough. Good job. That's it. Keep that rhythm. That looks good. Looks good. Get you in the New York Marathon before you know. Go. Oh. Good. Okay. Go for it. I'm going. About 11 to 12 miles per hour. I'm feeling it. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and your turn. Thanks, work. Good job. Looks good, man. Thanks. What kind of shoes are you wearing? Um, I'm running. Okay, I got to get a plug in there. I got you. <laughs> and good. Okay, last one. Do it. I'm still tired. 11 miles per hour, 12. I'm feeling it. So this is why we're doing four. Take a longer break after this. Yep. Five, four, three, two, one. Your turn. Finish this up. Looks good. And good. Nice. Oh, so let's walk and talk. So not too bad? No. Yeah. So I would do those, like say, I just did those intervals. I know with my family, we'll do like three sets of four, three sets of five, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. Longer day, we might go 60 like you did before. Yep. And the great thing, like, if we did this outside, I'd probably feel it more in my joints. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. You know? Um, so. Yeah, there's something good about this. When I got off this yesterday, I just felt taller. My hips yeah. actually felt a lot looser. It's got some sort of posterior chain reinforcement, right? So. Right. So if I, if we went for a jog now, it would feel like you were being pushed. Yeah. 100%. Down the road. 100%. So let's step off. Grab some water. And it's, yeah, where, where'd my water bottle go? Hold on. There you go. Thank you. I need a I need a team of assistants. Oh, thoughts. Funny, man. You're, you're sweating pretty good. You got a good pump there in the upper yeah. body. Yeah, it's fantastic. I mean, yeah, it's funny. Same thing happened yesterday. I kind of sweat an abnormal amount, but uh, I also think it's 
I don't have the air on in the room also, but it's, it just feels right. Um, and it's funny, once you start getting those knees up, man, you just feel like this burst. It almost feels like someone's removing the parking brake from the moving car. You're like, whoa, things just start kicking. I, I tend to overstride and stride too far. I almost reach with my stride too much for everyone listening out there. I, I think that's a baseball thing. You're always thinking, I got to make it to the ba first base, right? <laughs> yeah, 100%. But I can't use that excuse anymore. That was like 20, that was hey, 20, muscle 20 memory. years ago. You probably still have dreams or nightmares about that. Oh, yeah. That's funny. I, I had, I, I used to have this nightmare in college that it'd be my at bat and I couldn't get my cleats on or I couldn't get my batting gloves on. And coaches look at me like, come on, and I can't tie him. I can't get my batting gloves on. I can't find my bat. It's like this. And my, I remember my, my brother, who obviously was a professional golfer at one point, he uh, used to say that he'd have a dream that he'd have to hit a shot, his next shot he'd hit, and next thing he'd be standing in a telephone booth. And he couldn't move into heart. Oh, really fun. So, yeah, I mean, I, I just been, you know, working with this and now you have it, which is great. We can work back and forth. I like, I actually enjoyed that relay thing we did where I go, you go, because it was interesting. Yeah, we should do it again. When you want to hit it again, we'll, we'll figure it out. We, we should try and get this in once or twice a week. I think this is great. Yeah, yeah we can vary it up a bit and um, I, we can do everything from monitor heart rate, monitor velocity. Obviously, watch technique too, but yeah, uh, no, I, think I think it's great. I think it'd be interesting because people can also like they can pull this up with us, or you can almost say, "Hey, guys, do this with us," you know. And that's kind of what I want to do with people. Like, get out your treadmill if you have a treadmill, or you know, yeah, write down I your goals that we're doing. Ideally, everybody would have a true form, and you know, that's part of this. Like, you know, this is a really great product. Having said that, you're right. Somebody might have a regular motorized treadmill. Somebody may have another brand. <clears throat> you can still do some of the same workout, so it's not right. you know you're not limited, right? So I think. We're just providing knowledge right now, tested during this time. So, I love it. Right. Any final words? No, I'm good. <laughs> you? Uh, sweat, I'm a sweaty mess now. Thank you very much. All right. Nice. Well, how do you feel? Uh, I feel like I feel like I could go for another couple of sets, right? So, but you know, once once you break that sweat, sweat, it's it's actually uh, you get into a groove. It's really kind of right. interesting. I mean, obviously, you want to focus on your technique, but uh, you could be watching Netflix or whatever too. But uh, you know, listen to a good podcast, but once in a while, it's good just to get on there and focus on rhythm and technique. A hundred percent. I think you said it. I could continue to go on and push it. I think what do you tell people like today, the plan is, is that we're done, right? A another day, the plan is, is that we would continue, right? I mean, how do yeah. you talk about very, uh, very, yeah. Like if we did the very simple thing there, we did a warm up. we did our four short sprints and then we did four longer intervals. Easily you could do two sets of those sprints, three sets of those intervals, right? So that's, that's a, that's one heck of a workout. If you do that twice a week, I mean, that's yeah. really good. That's your, that's your high end running. And then you can do some walking and jogging and you know, obviously your weightlifting and all that too. But if you get that out of the way, like just think of like the circulatory work and just your lungs and your cardiovascular system and just flushing your system out and even just getting a good sweat like that. I mean, I, I just think you can't beat it. All right. Well, why don't we aim for, uh, why don't we aim for one or two days a week? I mean, I know you got to hit it with your family. So let's try and get at least one day a weekend then. Yeah, especially if the weather sucks. Or maybe I'll come for a run with the family one, one day. We can have some fun. <laughs> yeah. We'll just fly right, out. Come on. That's okay, fun, man. man. Thanks, 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 Great. Thanks, brother. Bye-bye. Yeah.